All right, people, welcome back. More Daily Duels. So today is Monday. We're not supposed to be playing Game of Puppets. We're really not. I, I kind of dropped the ball on that one. Uh, if you did not see, wow, wow, wow. Are you just gonna, are you just gonna scoop? Like, you made me go first, which I really don't want to. Uh, my hand's not terrible, but it's not great either. Like, I probably kind of do like a botch play first turn. Probably summon like Humpty Dumpty to summon Jerry Doll, and then <gasps> pretty much do nothing after that. Like. Uh, this was the one that copies the level, so, and then I at least have, you know, uh, junk puppets so I can revive, but I don't, I don't know, I don't know, you just kind of scooped, you know, 40 card deck, no, except that maybe you're playing Monarchs, or something zacky. Alright, I'm gonna do it. But yeah, I messed up. I, I don't think I messed up like this since maybe, like, the first month of Daily Duels coming back, uh, last November. And uh, doing this, uh, I accidentally gave the first set of card, the first set of decks, an additional week, and I did this time too. You know, I was just so busy being sick and discussing uh, pretty much how the uh, the regionals and shit went that I kind of skipped a week. I skipped a week, so rip, rip. So you get actually five uh, weeks of game puppets in the respective other decks. So this is okay. I can trade in this. I want to. Actually, I could just summon, summon, special summon, because my opponent controls a monster, I have control and give a puppet, and go into my spider. I would just be leaving this on the field, so rip, but uh, I think that's okay. I think, I think busting out the spider is actually pretty strong. As long as you can't be, you know, the spider, don't, don't fuck around, don't don't sleep on that spider. That spider, summon sins, is crazy good. It's a fucking 4,000 attack monster that protects itself from destruction, like, you you already know, like, that spider... That's probably will fuck you up. Uh, I've seen it. I've seen it. And, you know, busting off 5,000 tech monster right now in Yu-Gi-Oh! Nothing scoff at. I mean, trains can do it, and, you know, they can do it, and you already know it's it's not bad. So, we'll go ahead and just slap on a giant spider. 4,000 attack spider, protect us from destruction. If you don't kill it, and you have to some monsters, I can just go yum 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 yum, eat you up. So, you know, it, it, it's really, it's fairly decent. Oh no, it's a secret deck. Oh man, I wish I had Maxi. Ugh. I just drop the maxi on them, draw, draw a couple of cards, refill my hand. I'm a, I'm, I definitely have a feeling that he, if he's playing a Synchro deck, he could probably come back. Yeah, he could he could probably handle this uh, fourth on table. But generally, the Synchro monsters destroy, don't they? That's the problem. Top of my mind, I can't really think of a, a, a Synchro monster he can bust out that doesn't destroy all out. He can pitch the dandy, dandy goes off, gives you some tokens, like, alright. Oh wow, and Doppel, wow. He wants all the Synchro Summon, all the tokens. God, I wish I had Maxi right now. Hey, but the consistency is lowered. Maybe maybe if I would have traded in, but I think that play was fine. Empty Dumpty's useful. He, he summons that monster, but goddamn, and he just fucking sits here and does nothing. Oh no. Oh no, not broken ass TJ Hyper Librarian. TJ Hyper Librarian's broken. He should stay at like one for like ever. You know? Yep, yep. Synchro draw, 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 like it's not one per turn and it, like this card is fucking stupid. <laughs> uh, but yeah, I, I apologize, I apologize people. Anyway, school, school still going on, uh, oh right, right, Moonlight, Moonlight, kind of forgot about that card, I was, I was thinking, I was like, there's nothing you can really do, I forgot about Moonlight, completely, I was thinking Black Rose, completely forgot about Moonlight, like, rip, rip, rip me, rip, ripperonis. Wow, and this gets banished, even though, you know, that, that really sucks that this card gets banished. I mean, that card gets banished. Ugh. Ugh. Nice meme. Like, what do you mean, nice meme? Like, I guess. Like, ugh, if I had Max Lee, I would have drew, you know, a nice chunk of cards and it would still be in this duel. Now I'm pretty much struggling. Like, I need a given couple who's level 8. If I get a given couple who's level 8, I can come back into this duel. No, no, because with monsters level five or higher, special summon. Period. So moonlight pretty much just fucks me. Like, yeah, yeah. There's, there's not much I can do. Oh well, I can do that. That that definitely works. <laughs> that definitely works. I get the card. You get the card. Yeah, yeah. That that works. <laughs> I was like, oh shit. Never mind. Never mind. I I got my kaiju on. You know what? That's even better. This is. Wow, hello? <laughs> hello? <laughs> you can't be saying shit like that. 
Like, nigga, you're the one that fucking went into teaching how to bury and do the guard and shit like that? Like, wow. Wow, you don't call me a faggot. Like, you're, you're the one who summoned Moonlight and bounced my fucking awesome at seven cents. I am the faggot? All right. All right. Some people can be so rude. So rude. Ah. Like, I, I, you can t you can talk all the shit you want behind your computer screen where no one can hear you, you know? But you don't have to type that shit out. Wow, you're gonna call me a slur? I'm sorry, like, oh, oh, fucking BLS, let's go. Fucking jump out the bushes and stab me in my booty hole. Like, come on, man. Fucking BLS. Fucking BLS. And this card went up to two in the OCG? Fuck you, man. Fuck you. That was, it, BLS should never go any higher than fucking one. BLS is some straight up disgustingness. You already know. All right, well, you're about to lose your BLS, definitely. Right, there's no way in fuck I'm allowed to keep that. I'm probably just gonna trade in one of these guys. Like, I'm probably just gonna trade in him. Cause I need to get deeper into my fucking, uh, gimmick puppet shit, definitely. So, I'm probably gonna give you this over the BLS and I can still make a reggae play? Wow, scissors, all right, I guess. I mean, I can make Castell. Like, that's not what I needed at all. Uh, I think I'll make Castell. Just summon, summon, make Castell spin you away. I've tapped out here, or Topio, Topio Lightning, or whatever. Yeah, you Topio, Topio Lightning. It's all, it's all, it's all the same. It just I won't get this effect, but I guess that's okay. Yeah, I guess that's okay. Wow. Yeah, like BLS is at two in the OCG. If I go to three, like y'all, fucking crazy. Like y'all, like y'all, it seems like OCG doesn't even think about the fucking past or like anything with precedence. They're just like, hey, it hasn't done fucking anything in like the last 15 minutes. Let's go ahead and move it up on the ban list. Like, hell no to the no, no, no. That's how I feel about that shit. Like, fucking, they have three Chaos Emperors and fucking two BLS probably going on three. Like, they're just gonna send a shit ton of dark. There's probably gonna be like a Chaos deck that just sends a floodgate of dark and lights. Do like Dante and the Speedrun Ninja just well at least Dante's at one in the OCG, you know. Uh, but they have Troop Dupe Scoop, right? They have Triple Card Trooper, you know, send a whole bunch of Dark and Light monsters and then just some Chaos Emperor, Chaos Emperor, BLS, tack, 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 in, like, you know? They, they might come up with something like that. I'm gonna set this as bait, and if he wants to pop it, then, you know, with his own Toy Twitcher, at least he'll take a, a neg on it. And I mean, I seriously doubt I'll get use out of it because you know, I'm going against a Synchro deck. Problem I'd say right now is my life points since I'm only at 24. You can easily like get the right synchro cards, go off synchro summon a whole bunch of times, you know, and deal with my Utopia Lightning and more. So, and then dish out the 24. That's what I'm worried about. I mean, I got the I got the Gamma Seal, so that's nice. He doesn't know I have the Gamma Seal though. Yeah, he doesn't know I have the Gamma Seal. All right, well, whatever that is, I have. Of course, I have uh, Utopia Lightning, so. All right, well, I mean, I can bust out another gimmick puppet play, and I think I'll do it. I think I'll bust out just another spider. The spider is just so good. Seven cents. So I can do that, and then once we turn, I can target one gimmick puppet, and it becomes that level. I have an eight in here, right? I believe I have him. Can you switch some? Yeah, okay. I was making sure I read over everything before I fluck this up. So you're going to be taking a nice chunk of damage. A nice chunk of damage. I'm gonna say if I put this over this, I was like, would that be enough for game? But then no. Now if I had, you know, enough to detach for another uh, Utopia Lightning boost, then yeah, it would be. But I don't know. I don't know. I'm still debating on whether I should like put if I'm in a rim lightning running the race, I can get two hits out of this effect. But generally, one hit is enough to you know handle the situation. Even after that, he's not dead. He's still a 2500 or maybe he's, you know. So. Go slap you on, you have that nice booty, and then slap you on. Sends again. I'm not sure how many uh, moonlights he runs. You know, he only had, you know, I wouldn't be surprised if he calls me some other racial slur. Oh, no, no, no not this time. Now it's just, I'm a bitch motherfucker. Like, alright, alright, alright. Oh, and there goes the... In the ghetto, no. I, I just live on a major street, so... Anyway, let's get another dual pair back. But, uh, the class, I don't know, I don't know. Despite being sick, I still gotta do a shit ton of school work, and... Uh, this is, like, think my fifth out of the six education courses that I gotta take. Wow, he made me go first. I'm not gonna do anything. Especially since I got the Kaiju Slumber, like, I'm just drawing these Humpty Dumpty's, they ain't doing anything, because I'm not drawing any of my gimmick puppets, like... 
I don't know. I don't know. It's the Dr. Mission Girl, the Apprentice Illusion Magician. Let's go. All right. So, probably definitely hit you with the slumber. <laughs> and then set the Eternal Soul. Oh, get and navigate. Uh huh. Like, this is gonna be fun. This is gonna be fun on the bun. Oh, just the Dark Condition. I mean, with the high consistency of her grabbing you Dark Condition and shit, why not? It's an ass ton of background. Play alert. Did you get it? Wow, I'm the Goku Grab Magician too. Okay. You could just use him as a normal summon and then declare six with her. Wow, wow, all the alert. All the draw. Sacred Sword, Allure, Allure, like, holy shit. This man's getting deep and tight, his deck. Yep. Yep. And turn into Dark Paladin. Yep. Oh, there goes over half my line points. Like, holy shit, this guy went off and still has plays. Oh, obviously, I know what this card is. Question is, does he have the monster in his hand to summon? He's already got rid of a nice chunk of Dark Magicians. Uh, if I do this, then I can't. I can't do that, right? You can just whenever a spell is activated, you can just pretty much negate. So I would love to just do this, but he'll negate that with this, obviously. And there's no way he'll allow me to get to trade it off. Maybe I can summon these two, go into like a cast out to bait him, and then try to spin the Dark Paladin, and then handle this. Maybe crash. I don't know. I don't know. The question with the thing with crashing. Is that he might have more plays next turn? I'm hoping that the the that the navigate will be dead. Let me let me check the log. Navigation, but no. Let me let me see navigation. Navigation. Special summon one dark magician from your hand. This special summon. Yeah, like you already burned through two dark. Through all three of your dark magicians active. Actually, one, two, and then one's in the graveyard, right? Three. So your navigation is dead. Yeah, your navigation is dead. So. I'm hoping that with that, I don't have to worry about you summoning Dark Mission anymore. <laughs> wow, wow. And he has the maxi? Like, yeah, just give this man draws for days, motherfucker. God damn it. God damn it, that's annoying. Don't you do something? Oh, you boost. Yeah, I think I'll cast Ellen Crash. Like, wow, wow, wow. The lures, the sacred swords, the ma the maxis, like, holy shit! This man drew up a shit storm. I'll crash with you. It's better than leaving you on the field. Wish I had other shit. And I just gotta hope and pray that he won't be able to bless out thirty one. But with no dark magician, I mean, I don't know. I don't know. You know what? I can always foolish and send. Uh, the one who can summon from the graveyard if I take any damage, so that's nice. I'll trade in deeper into my deck. Yeah, I got my, got my rank up magic, so that's cool. And another kaiju. Yeah, I'm okay for right now. Hopefully, cross my fingers that he won't be able to bust out 31. But with no Dark Magician and your Dark Magician deck, like, I don't know. It's all of them are gone, man. You, you, you got too thirsty. You alerted him. You sacred sworded him. You pitched him to the grave. Whoa, another. Another circle, I mean, you already have one. One is already big enough for that. Never mind, you have Eternal Soul. Never mind. I was thinking that you didn't have any more Dark Magicians, but when you, you know, do Dark Magic Circle, whenever I do Dark Magic Circle, I never reveal. Like, I never reveal. This man got Navigate and Eternal Soul. Like, rip. <laughs> ah, and there's, like, nothing I can do either. Like, that's a sad thing. Like, he might have this. He might have this, because he could just summon Dark Magician during my end phase and, and then summon something else. Like, I didn't do anything this turn, but I didn't activate your eternal soul, summon Dark Magician during the end phase, normal summon something else that literally has like 600 attack technically for game. If you have it. He has two eternal souls? Because I believe this is a set eternal soul. Wow. Wow. Whew. Whew. The luck is too strong. Yeah, yeah, the luck is too strong. Alright, we'll get another duel. Bear back. Yeah, I, that was not a good duel for me. I didn't, I didn't open up well at all. Like, <sighs> why did I why did I mess up and give this and give these decks another week? Like I'm sick of giving pop hits. This deck is just not that great. Like it really isn't. Like without the rank up, the deck is not that great. Going to seven tens, it's just oh my god, really? Oh my god, like 
Yeah, right. Facing that top tier shit, boys. All right. Well, I can go into my spider. <laughs> that wouldn't be terrible. Going into uh, into my big spider. But ABCs, like, all right. You gonna max see me? Please don't max see me. Please don't. Please don't. Oh my god, why does everybody get maxi but me? Oh my god, man. I don't want to do this duel anymore. Be right back. Oh my god. Can I get my maxi this time? Please? No. Alright. Alright. <laughs> I'm tired of it, man. I can only get the maxi me all fucking day long and I can't fucking maxi them. Like, oh my god. You lower the consistency down and still fucking get it like a motherfucker. Like, alright. Uh, it's that new spirit shit. That spirit ritual shit. Alright. I mean, him bouncing my shit back to my hand, non-targeting bouncing. I mean, at least it's not non-targeting spinning, but still. And then that draw that you can get off of the uh, monsters. Wow. The only one necros, because why not? Necro spirits and stuff. Like, okay. Oh. Of course, you got the, the unicorn. Yep, yep. Yeah. It means that one, so the number generation is strong with that one. Even if he does anything too crazy, I do have the kaiju, which is I don't have really anything else, but at least I got an upstart and desire, so maybe I can draw into something with that. Yeah. And he went hella plus. Started off with five, ended up with seven. But pre prep is a plus, and that play was a. That play plus? Yeah, that play was a plus. That play was a plus because you tribute that monster from your extra deck, which doesn't it's not a resource and you got the search off. Yeah, yeah you plussed. You plussed. Got another kaiju, so that's awesome. So I can summon the kaiju and you a kaiju and summon the kaiju. I don't know what the fuck that's gonna do. Uh, during the two desires, if you have a certain monster you control the strength of the hand, you could while you control the spell a trap, you could pop a face up. So you card your punk controls pop it. Wow, that's really good. I drew my rank up, Kyrie, but I can't even go into any of my fucking plays. Awesome. 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 Well, I can give him the Kaiju and summon the Kaiju and run over the Banjo. That might be best so he doesn't do any rank f rank plays. Like, you don't need that. And then I guess if he wants to crash, he can crash. Like, wow, this is probably one of the most booty hat hands. I need desires and still get nothing. A plus one but of, of a pot of greed and I still had nothing. Like, ugh. Oh, no, nope, this is my fault why this deck's not doing so hot. When your opponent cards attack, you can banish your spirit monster from a graveyard to negate the attack. <coughs> That's annoying. You can just keep walking and walking and walking and walking, like, alright. Kinda wanna set up this too. Cause you could just summon a spirit monster to return, but I, I can just summon whatever spirit monster he summons, so. He still, he still has resources. <laughs> Oh, maybe I should have set the Twin Twister. Uh, I can solve him that. Yeah, I think solve him that would be good. So, I wish he paid the cost first, but no. Nah. Because once he hits the field, I can't solve him because he's still summons already his own. And if I strike, this is a situation where I'd have him strike over solemn warning. His strike would be, would be like stop your monster effect after you, you know, pay your cost for tributing. Strike would have been better in that in that niche situation. I think when it comes to like possibly fusion and ritual, I think strike is better. But then warning is overall better because I get to stop the summon period, including like you know, just normal summons. I don't know. They're 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 both just ridiculously good. They both deserve to be at one. All right, that's fun. Oh, trade them would be fantastic. So that's the main desire. Fuck it. All the cards in my deck, as long as I have plays. I could trade in that. I feel like I can really summon that and draw some more. I'll draw. I got foolish, so I can foolish and I can summon that. See, I could go into a play. Huh. 
could go into a play. I could go into this guy who I barely go into. This card can't be targeted by card effects, even though I don't believe your ritual monster targets. But I have strike, so. And then draw a card off of that, because this guy's not gonna do anything. I don't like pop if I, you know, do that play. Hopefully I have one more in my deck. I'm gonna banish. Nope, nope, I still have a doll. Cool. I was gonna say, did I banish them all? I'm like, no, he didn't. Like, cool. Um, uh, think about Twin Toy Story and then just popping both these cards, because I don't want you to interrupt my plays right now. Yep, 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 it was a strike. Ah! Ah, see, I was like, I don't want you to interrupt my plays, and you're not. I guess I'll banish Feeler, Summon Doll, Summon Changer, Changer, copy the level. Is that I can go ahead and draw a card, burn you for a thousand. I mean, burn you for like 800. Just the fact that I get to draw a card is nice. The question is, is am I going to leave him here? I mean, he has 38, and then I get to draw a card pretty much every turn, so... I think I'll, I think I'll probably leave it. Instead of going into Spider? I don't think I'm going into Spider anyway. I got, no, I can only come and give him puppets this turn, so I can't go into Spider anyway. Hey, I might actually beat him, especially with the tell him strike. Like, if he doesn't get, like, a Twin Twister or MST and he attempts to Ritual Summon again. The thing is that his Ritual card fizzled, so. So if you don't kill him, I get to draw another card and burn you. This card cannot be targeted, so that's nice. There's nothing to scoff at, but big monster that can't be targeted. I mean, just look at uh, Cosmos. But yeah, class is just, ugh. Like, same teacher, lesson plans, lesson plans, work, work, work. Like, it's, it's a pain, but, I mean, I'll get it, I'll get it done. I'll get it done. Alright, ugh. Like, so if you're not gonna do anything, I get to just draw cards and burn you. <laughs> uh, I could summon her back again, and then summon this. This might be game. This might be game, because I can summon her... Then, no, all my monsters I control are giving puppets. This isn't giving puppets, and so no, I can't do that play. Uh, do you have any attack, doll? No, you're me, of course, you're zero. <laughs> I was thinking, I was wondering, I was like, do you have any attack? I might be able to poke. <coughs> Excuse me. No, I'll just attack. Uh huh. Alright, go ahead. Get one more draw and burn. Well, possible burn. The draw is just nice. Oh shit, pre-prep. This card's so good. I, I wouldn't be surprised if, if something ritually related was so good that pre-prep eventually gets hit. You're gonna send one of him to summon one of him, activate the effect, and then catch the swift to solemn strike in your entire fucking life. Like, nah. That's game. I don't think you really have anything else. You know, one resource since I have a 28 monster, yeah. Can't be targeted. He doesn't target, so that's good, but no. Uh, one more duel. One more duel. Bear back. Alright, this will probably be the last duel. Oh, I got lucky on that one. I just happened to actually draw into the hatred instead of back row. <laughs> uh, this hand's not that great. If I, if, if I could bust out a rank A play, then I got my rank up card, so that's decent. But outside of that, and depending on what I'm playing against. Like, I'm playing against that top tier shit, and then hell no. <laughs> I'll just set one and end. Okay. Even though you didn't open until. Oh, don't you just hate when you just draw that six card at that maxi? Like, what if you went off his special summon all that shit during his turn? Ah, I don't got anything either, sir. Hopefully, you'll, like, go off on a special summon tangent and I'll get to draw a couple cards off this maxi. I finally got it. Like, let me get some. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. That's fine. I'm not even sure how much he's gonna special summon. Oh no. The I to 10, the Ben 10, like, oh. I already know. You know, summon that monster that, you know, it's like a snatch, steal, snatch my shit up. And the Cyber Angel bitch. I'll maxi that. At least I get one card. At least I get one draw. This is guaranteed one draw. <laughs> Yep, Ben 10, I did it. Wow. Uh, I'm just drawing this shit. That awkward moment when fucking shit's not shuffled properly. Like, alright. 
uh, you get pretty much a double search. You get the the ritual spell and the ritual. I mean, and the fairy monster. Like, all right. Like, uh, <laughs> I'm probably gonna lose this toll. I don't got nothing right now. Oh, and it's Herald. Thank God, I'm running fucking kaiju's. Like, so are you gonna actually summon him this turn and give me an additional draw? Like, you are. Okay, you're like, fuck it. I'm running Herald. I I don't care. Wow. And then you got a tribute I to ten. Then gain that thousand attack. And the Herald of Dawn will give you that fairy back to your hand. Like, Herald plus fucking Cyber Angels. It's like the perfect combination. Perfect combination. Yep. It's interesting that he's actually playing that I to 10. Like, you really need a 3800 booty. Like, for 3800 attack, like, you could put him in some of the attack line and attack me. Like, come on, man. You done? You gonna poke me for 300? Just like, wow, you're not even gonna poke me for 300. You're like, no, nah, fuck that. I'm not even gonna do that. Like, okay. I guess. So, I mean, I could do a rank play, it's just, the question is, will I be okay with this back row? I don't see this deck playing too much back row. You don't need that. Ah, uh, fucking, fucking kaijus, man. They're so fucking crispy, like, holy shit. Kaijus are, like, one of the best, an uh, pretty much, like, the best answer to everything. Like, holy shit. They're, like, the thoughtless fucking get handle any situation. So good. Uh, I could go into you and then pop your shit, but I don't think that's necessary. You're so you're fucking Humpty Dumpty, you're so fucking pathetic that you can't even handle that. Yeah, I guess I'm gonna have to go into my uh, rank up gimmick puppet lady. What's that? I don't see this deck playing too much back row. Everybody gets some string counters, then I'll rank up. You can protect the Petite Angel from dying, but I mean, is that really necessary? Doesn't he have his uh cyber under shit? Yeah, you get to pop and then I get to draw. Uh I didn't normal summon, right? Uh detach Ronnie. If I would have detached this. No, because it would have banished. Uh I mean I can go into my spider. But I wouldn't be game. This card's normal special summon. This card's normal summon not special summon. Ooh, I can do this. I wait, I can go into my spider. Then I can do this. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. We might, we might have something. We might have something. We might have game, like, right here, right now. Rank up, sure. You can grab me that back. Why not? <coughs> oh, excuse me. I'm still sick. And this might be, like, the dumbest play. This might be, like, the dumbest play, but I can actually go for game. Because I can use my gimmick puppet, summon this, and this can summon me my 1,000 attack feeler, right? No, I can only use the effect of Humpy Dumpy once per turn. Rip, rip, rip. Wow. I say, say I thought I thought it was gonna be game. I thought I could summon him, summon the feeler attack for exactly one thousand game. And nope, I, I didn't read that last part. Ah, well, that gives him uh, cards and resources and plays to come back on my ass. Like, rip. The problem is if he goes into Herald, he can't do much. But I mean, what's to say he won't get stick chair? Going to you know draw a couple cards, going to Ouroboros. Like, come on. Just Harold can't stop me. Like, that's the thing. I know you have Ben 10 and Ida 10. I know that for sure. You got another ritual card? What are your sets? Like, I know this back row doesn't play, I mean, this deck doesn't play a lot of back row because it relies on Harold to negate. Oh, you had, I had a set, Machine Angel Ritual. Like, all right, the bluffs are real. <laughs> all right, so you pretty much need to figure out how to get out of this situation because if you don't, then all I have to do is just attack over the Senju. Like, that was my bad. I, I, I messed that up. <laughs> I mean, I still have to play next turn. Oh, Dakini. Oh, shit. <laughs> yep. That'll definitely do it. I'll handle my spider, right? Cause don't you just send my monster? Yeah. Then you kill my Humpty Dumpty. And then main phase two, you summon Dakini. And then Dakini makes me send my seven sins. Yep, yep, yep. With additional attack, too. Yep. And you get to grab something back during the end phase, but I think I still have a play because I can go normal puppet summon you, you summon you, I can normal summon you, uh, make you the same level as you, and then just go into uh, a rank up play. The only problem I'd say is that I only run one of my rank up monsters, that the gimmick pup boss ass bitch, so 
And I guess I can go into what's his face, the one that I get to burn and draw a card. Oh, this would be really risky, because I have the play right now. I think I should just do the play. The question is, can I end this duel with the play? That's the question. I go to you, burn. Yeah, draw a card, burn. Any 300 can't be targeted, but I mean, that community doesn't target it, so. I can go into uh, Grinder, and then rank up off of Grinder after popping you. Yeah, yeah, I think that'd be best. So, once again, as long as he doesn't have any back row, I think I'll be okay. Doesn't look like I'm a misplay will end up biting me in the ass. That, that was bad. That was bad. And I at least got summoned in defense mode. Like, what was I thinking? I, I was thinking I was just so thirsty for the W. I was like, I, it's like I got it. All I gotta do is inflict a thousand to him. It's like, no. <laughs> you fucked up. You done goofed. Alright, so I can just go into Grinder. Grinder can detach X material pop, then rank up, and then tech for a game. So. Oh, wait, no, he has a uh, Machine Angel Ritual. He has two of them, actually. Never fucking mind. He has two of them. Shit. <laughs> I forgot about Machine Angel Ritual. Alright, well, if I detach two X materials, and he blocks twice, and then I rank up and I run him over, will he die? Shit. The scene in the ritual is so good. What? What do you mean Humpty Dumpty's monster effect? What? No. Like, you're about to probably crash on me, fucking. Uh. Uh, why'd you go crawling? So, now I can just run you over. <laughs> so, this card cannot be targeted, blah 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 blah, so. Draw a card, burn for a thousand. Trade in. And I. Th no. Oh, wow. Wow, I drew into the fucking uh, Gamma Seal. So I can just give it to Gamma Seal and then attack over the Gamma Seal for a game. Ah, ah. See, that wouldn't have been. I don't think that would have been good. Well, I was only 100 stronger than you because I fucking did that play. I'm not stronger than you. Ah. Wow, we'd be Cyber Angels. We'd be some ritual butt today. Alright, we're gonna call episode Daily Duel, so. Ah, I said I messed up, so we get one more week. So anyway, I hope that you guys enjoyed. Uh, I'll see you guys tomorrow playing at Mechor Despot. It's not the greatest of decks, but still playing it because fuck me, you know, because it's really all my fault. I, I could have been free if I would have just done things properly because I fucked up. Like, this is my punishment. So thanks for watching, thanks for support, and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Thanks for watching.